Hello all, in this video we are going to see different types of mapping functions in Spring Boot. In the previous tutorial what we have did is we have created a student class and that we have considered as entity and for that student class we have created something called as repository and for that repository class we have created something called as uh, service using those service methods like load data we have loaded the content into the database and uh, we know that in database we'll have several tables and uh, this several tables will have some mapping functions and this kind of mapping can be done with the help of this mapping functions in Spring Boot and uh, in JPA we have many types of uh, mapping functions so that is one-to-one -one mapping and we have two types of one-to-one -one mapping where one-to-one -one mapping with the help of shared primary key and one to one mapping with the help of foreign key and we have one to many relationship mapping then many to many relationship mapping and many to many using extra column relationship mapping so in this video we will see the uh, definition and the concept of this types of mapping and in the next upcoming tutorials we will see the practical implementation of this mapping so we will start with the first mapping that is one to one mapping so we have uh, two co concepts of one-to-one -one mapping that is using shared primary key and also a foreign key. So in shared primary key what we what it will do is consider there is a table called book and there is a, another table called book detail where in book we have ID and the name of the book and this ID is act as a foreign key of the book ID of book detail. Normally when we have a foreign key this id and this id should be name should be same but here what you can see is the id in the book table is id and id in the book detail is book underscore id so this is not actually the primary key and the foreign key concept but actually this is the concept of shared primary key so if they have a different name but if they are using the primary key and foreign key concept then it is said to be a shared primary key concept and here we have a book followed by book id and name of the book and this id is a foreign key has book underscore id and number of pages in it so this is like one to one mapping and we have another type called one to one mapping with the help of foreign key so in the previous case what we did is we have uh, had a added a primary key as id and uh, we have not created a foreign key here but we have used this uh, we have shared this primary key to this table but what in one to one mapping using foreign key is we will have will create a primary key as id and we have uh, something called as name in the book name but this primary key has a foreign key of uh, id with the same name id and id and this book detail has the number of pages so this is called the concept of one to one mapping with the help of foreign key whereas in one to one mapping with the help of shared primary key has this we, we have a primary key but we don't have the foreign key but we share this primary key into it so the third type is one to many mapping consider we have a book category and book so whereas uh, this book has id and the name of the book and the category and this category will maps to a book category and again the book category will have id and the name of that category so this is like one to many and we have many to many mapping where publisher and book uh, has a many to many rela relationship with the help of uh, book publisher and we have another thing called many to many mapping using extra column but here what we can do we can see is we don't see any extra column here but in many to many, many mapping we have something called as extra column using this extra column the many to many mapping works so in the upcoming tutorials we will see uh, each and every mapping with a detailed uh, example so our next video is about one to one mapping with shared primary key concepts so these are the mapping key available or mapping functions available in Spring Boot. Thank you.